Hey everybody, it's Mama Jan. I'm back again with some more pop protectors. This time I bought the ones so I can protect some of my handmade by robots. Now I know that they did have them on their website at one point, but I know when I went and looked recently, they had, it says coming soon, and it was like a package of 24 for 60 bucks. Really isn't that bad. Makes them like two something a piece. I know that the ones that I bought off uh, seven bucks a pop for the pop protectors were three fifty dollars each. But I'm okay with that. So I have them right here. All right, we're going to pop them open. Now I only bought two because I just want to see how they fit. Already these are, these are the pop protectors I use for my pops. I know a lot of people have different um, opinions on what they want to use. I've liked these since the get-go pretty much never really switched all right so again let's go ahead we're gonna build the push the sides down in all the way remember and then pull them back out all the way same thing with the lid it helps with the flatness pull this back out i know some people are really massive you want to see some full collections of handmade by robots go check out geek meets eats she's got a ton of them uh, i believe she has almost all of them if not all of them <laughs> all right i'm a little more pickier same thing with pops i'm one of those people that have a very small tight limited collection same thing with the handmade by robots but obviously i have my eddie which is one of my favorites so he will slide right in there always with the flap to the front then you can pull this plastic off all right i'm going to close it up not only does it help protect them but it helps with the dust all right and see how it's in there nice squared off at the top because we folded it so that's pretty awesome the other one i have obviously is my wonder woman this actually was my first handmade by robots this was actually the last one i got but the wonder woman was the very first one that i ever got i had not bought any until i seen that wonder woman all right let me get this one open again fold the sides help square it off a little all right in and out I, I can't stress it. It makes a huge difference if you just take that few extra seconds. All right, pull it back out. All right, and then again, front facing the flap. I know some people put the latch in the front. I think the latch is much better in the back. Pull off the extra plastic. in there so these were 350 a piece so i got two of them cost me seven dollars at a coupon so um cost me less than that actually but there we go we have two of them they're nice they're protected i think 350 a piece yeah you know i mean if you're having to buy a hundred of them you know at 350 a piece that's a lot of money so seriously once handmade by robots has theirs up I'm not sure who's making their pop protectors for them. Maybe seven bucks a pop. I know they've made them for other people because you can get them with the customization on the top. I have seen them come through like that. Uh, Stop, Pop, and Roll used to have them like that. I'm sure there are other ones, but Stop, Pop, and Roll was one of my favorite mystery box companies when they were around. Unfortunately, Mark is no longer doing that because obviously it's Funko's changing. Funko's changing. I, I, you know, especially when you're looking and you're seeing pops for five bucks being sold somewhere, even if the PPP, PPPP, PPG is higher. So don't forget, check that out. Make sure you leave a comment. That comment can get you entered in a giveaway and stick around. Check out my Patreons. They get something every month. And if you're interested, there's a link down below. Otherwise, we will see you in the next one. Keep on rocking.